from WFSB, this is an Eyewitness News Update. Hello and thanks for joining us. Here's a look at some of the day's top stories. I'm Stephanie Simone. And I'm Irene O'Connor. We start in New Haven, where police are investigating a deadly shooting in the Fairhaven neighborhood. This happened Monday near the intersection of Ferry Street and Wilkett Street. No word yet on any suspects or arrests. As soon as we have more details, we'll let you know both on air and online. In East Hartford, an investigation is underway after a shooting involving police officers. It happened Sunday afternoon on Governor Street. Police say officers were responding to a disturbance at an auto body shop, but did not provide any specific details. Two officers were taken to the hospital for evaluation. Both have been released. We are working to learn more about this, and we will have updates once again on air and online. I'm Mark Dixon here in the First Alert to Forecast Center for our Tuesday after some morning fog becoming mostly sunny temperatures, uh, even warmer than Monday, well into the mid 80s inland, a little bit cooler near 70 at the shoreline, uh, 70 to 75 depending upon your location, a bit muggier on Wednesday, uh, our last dry day, temperatures inland close to 90, chance for some afternoon thunderstorms uh, on Thursday with the arrival and passage of a cold front behind that less humid but still unseasonably warm Friday. The holiday weekend starts dry and bright with unseasonably warm temps turning cooler, perhaps unsettled by Memorial Day Monday.